Aloha everybody, my name is Charles and this is the USGS report for Thursday, April 1st, 2021. At 8.41 a.m. Hawaii Standard Time, the USGS posted that the lava infusion from the west vent continues to supply the lava lake within the Halemaumau crater. The west vent is consistently infusing lava at a low rate through a crusted over channel and submerged inlet to the lake. Lava circulation and intermittent foundering of the crust continue in the western portion of the lava lake, while the total depth of the lake is 224 meters or 735 feet this morning, April 1st, as measured by a continuous laser rangefinder on the active western portion of the lake. Stagnant and solidified lava crust continue or crust covers the eastern portion of the lava lake and is slowly growing westward. Current east drift zone observations show that there is no unusual activity noted in the region, while geodetic monitors indicate that the summit and upper east rift zone between the summit of Puoo is refilling at rates similar to those measured over the past two years and before the December 2020 eruption. SO2 and H2S emissions from Puoo were below instrumental detection levels when last measured on January 7th. Summit observations show the most recent sulfur dioxide emission rates measured on March 31st were 700 tons per day. This is elevated compared to the rates in the months before the eruption starting on December 20th, which were less than 100 tons per day. But lower, uh, but lower than emission rates from the pre-2018 lava lake, which were around 5,000 tons per day. Summit tilt meters recorded neutral tilt over the past day, which is no inflationary or deflationary trends, while seismicity remained stable with elevated tremor. And that'll pretty much do it for today's update from the USGS. Mahalo for watching, and you have an amazing morning, afternoon, or evening.